Hello friends, it's Faith from Fireside Tarot again. Sorry I'm a little late. I kind of overslept this morning. It was a rough weekend. It was a rough weekend. I think um, I worked 40 hours and approximately 13 hours of sleep. So, all right. And that was collective over like a four day period. Anyway, but we're here and we're gonna throw down some cards. It's Monday. So, it's time for the work week top and bottom of the deck. For those of you who are new here and don't know how we do this, we go by the elements. It is now Leo season, thank God. Just saying, I needed a little fire in my life again. So we'll start with fire, go around, go around the wheel accordingly. If it resonates, it resonates. If it doesn't, it doesn't. Check your moon rising and Venus sign readings. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. And cross watchers are always welcome. So, without further ado, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. What's going on with you guys this week? The devil in the verse. World in the upright. So far, I like it. We're disconnecting from some toxic, possibly oppressive or obsessive energy, closing the cycle out. I like it. Could be a Capricorn you're deciding to no longer deal with. Take it however resonates. If it sets off an alarm in your brain, cool. If it doesn't, move on from it. All right. How'd this all start? Hanged man in the upright. King of cups in the reverse. Could have been a Pisces you were dealing with. Maybe. Accepting the fate of a situation. Emotionally closing yourself off. From something, someone. Losing the feels, maybe. We'll throw a clarifier on it. What happened after that? Lovers in the reverse, Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. Connection still there, not mutually felt. It's Ace of Pentacles in the reverse. It just wasn't there. Wasn't meant to grow, possibly. We'll throw a clarifier on it. I'm not feeling the back porch coming off that card. Know what I'm saying? We'll give it a minute. All right. And as for this week, Queen of Pentacles in the reverse, Empress in the reverse. Oh, man. Really? Really? Oh. That's needy, clingy, codependent energy. Got two Gemini cards here, if that's setting off anybody's alarms. Well, fire sign friends, it seems to me you've already accepted the fate of this, so... Why is it going to come back to bite you this week? Well, throw some clarity on that. Maybe you didn't take time to process it. Maybe. Maybe, maybe. Hold on. Some of you could be having self-worth issues. This could possibly have to deal with someone that you have a family with. Possibly have a child with. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards and the table for my fire sign friends, please? Alright, what the hell? We'll just clarify them all. Why is the hanged man up right here?
Tower reversed. Mm. This is why we clarify. Some of you may have accepted the fate of this situation after you tried to prevent the tower from falling or rebuild it. Could be a Scorpio you're dealing with. Lovers reversed. The connection was not mutually felt. It was not as strong for one person as it was the other. Why is the King of Cups reversed here? This King of Cups reversed may be the other person's energy. Maybe they were emotionally closing themselves off to you. Three of Wands reversed. Someone decided to stop waiting. One more. King of Cups reversed. I don't make this crap up, guys. I don't make this crap up. You watch me shuffle. They fly as they fly. They land as they land. Emotional closing off. I'm done. I'm not waiting for it anymore. I'm not going to try to rebuild this. I'm accepting it. I'm walking away. Okay. Why is the lovers reversed here? Knight of Swords comes out. Oh gosh. Somebody was peeking in on somebody's Instagram or Facebook or whatever, possibly. They could have been peeking in on you. Maybe you saw something on theirs. One more. Oh, I don't like that Knight of Swords. I don't like it at all. If you're going to walk away, walk away. The Sun and the Eight of Swords. Okay. <laughs> Possibly they came in and communicated with you. So they wanted to make the sun shine in your world again, maybe. Hmm. Now you're all eight of swords. All up in your head about it. Why is the Ace of Pentacles reversed here? Two of Swords reversed. One more. Five of Cups. There's the processor. Maybe for some of you, walking away wasn't such an easy decision. If there is a house plant involved, you just didn't put it on the back deck. You threw it out in the trash. Now you, some of you may be having some regrets. Possibly. Why is the Queen of Pentacles reversed here for what's coming in this week? Queen of Pentacles reversed. The moon. Ace of Cups reversed. Some of you are having self-worth issues. Feeling left in the dark by a, by a few things. Pisces energy coming back up. Mm -hmm. 
Some of you may be wondering if it would have worked out. Can I get one more on that, please? What would have happened if the cup hadn't been spilled? Page of Wands reversed. You're a little stuck. You're stuck. Why? Because you went all in swords. That's why. Judgment reversed. Oh, gosh. What if? What if? What if? Why is the Empress reversed here? Queen of Swords reversed. Some of you may be developing a little bit of a bad attitude. more. Well, the fortune reversed. Kicking yourself in the butt. Why did I do that? Fire signs were prone to that. We are. Sometimes we don't look before we leap. And then we fall flat on our face. I think we had a conversation about this few readings back. One more clarifier, we're going to get some advice. Some of you may be wishing you could turn back the clock, kicking yourself in the butt, having a bad attitude about things. And the Four of Swords reverse pops out, you're feeling a little restless. This is coming to a close. There was toxic energy here. It was oppressive. Could have been on your part. Could have been on theirs. Sometimes fire signs are very prone to I want what I want. I want it now. And we can get a little bit overbearing. It happens. Some of us don't know what we want from one minute to the next. That's what happens too. Let's get your advice to get you through this, fire sign friends. The moon in the reverse. Four of pentacles in the reverse. You weren't meant to know why. So don't hang on to it anymore. Because the longer you hang on to it, and the longer you ask yourself, why, 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 the longer you're going to drag this out. A couple more. Eight of Cups reversed, Chariot in the reverse. You gotta be in charge of your own chariot. Go off on your path. Your paths cross again. It was maybe meant to be. If they don't, then it wasn't. Don't dwell on it. You gotta drive your own chariot. Even if it's not meant to be toxic forever, right now it is. And right now this needs to close. Three of Swords reversed and the Five of Wands. You need to process this sadness and allow yourself to come out of it and stop trying to fight the clock. Don't fight the process. Star in the reverse, the King of Wands in the reverse. If you allow yourself to stay stuck and do not move forward, you will not heal. You have to allow yourself to heal. 
we have to allow whatever is going to happen happen. Again, if it's meant to close, it will. If it's not, it'll come back around. But you got to drive your chariot where it's meant to go, where you want it to go. But if you want to stay in an emotionally closed off situation, by all means, you know, it's your life, not mine. I just read the cards. Do what you want. Hey, okay, Fireside and Friends, that's what I have for you. Hope it helps. I get them all to make sure I got them all. These little witches tarot cards, sometimes they hide in the deck and I don't find them. Then I get weird readings. I'm like, why is this not making sense? Oh, that's why. Okay, Earth sign friends, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. It's coming in for you guys this week. Eight of Pentacles reversed, Eight of Swords in the upright. Oh, good gosh golly. Some of you may be finding it difficult to concentrate on work or put work into anything this week because you're all consumed by something. Something has a grasp on you this week. Hmm. Okay. What's on your mind? Earth sign. High Priestess in the Upright, Three of Swords in the Reverse. It's a connection. Divine one at that. Probably a very spiritual deep one. Like 5D kind of stuff. Coming out of the sadness about it, though. You may have seen it coming. We'll throw a clarifier on it in a minute. Queen of Pentacles reversed, set in the upright. Mm. Some of these clingy and needy. Possibly a little high maintenance. Possibly. Connection still there. I'm going to throw a clarifier on that Queen of Pentacles. It just knocked the wind out of your sails a little bit. It's like antsy energy. Hesitation. Alright, what's coming in this week? Three of Cups reversed, Ten of Swords reversed. Mm, ah, yeah. Two reverse threes. Huh. Possibly coming out of a third party ish issue or situation, maybe? 
I don't see a reunion coming, and I don't see you letting this go anytime soon. Earth sign friends, I want the sun to shine in your world. Let's dig a little bit deeper, figure out why the sun isn't going to shine so yet. You know you control the sunshine in your world, right? It's not what people do. It's how we react. You you understand that, right? As cool as it would be, we cannot control the actions of other people. I mean, some of us can, but that's... It's not my thing. It's not what I do. Universe source and spirit, can I get some clarity? The cards on the table for my earth sign friends, please. Huh. Huh, huh, huh. Why is the high priestess here? Seven of Swords. saw this coming. You saw this coming. Somebody was sneaking around about something. Nine of Pentacles reversed. Dependence, not independent. Not necessarily being the catch that they said they were, maybe. King of Pentacles reversed. Yeah, no. They were not what they made themselves out to be. I think you knew. Why is the Three of Swords reversed here? Nine of Cups. Trying to come out of that state of sadness. Trying to fill your cups with the right things. Trying to stay positive. Reversed, but there's still that emotional hang up. One more. Just to even the energy out. One more. Queen of Cups reversed. Putting the face on. Some of you maybe think your cup wasn't good enough. I don't like that energy, Earth Signs. I don't like that energy. Why is the Queen of Pentacles reversed here? Four of Wands reversed. Strength reversed comes out. It's Leo energy. May have been a Leo you're dealing with or disconnecting from. Possibly. Doesn't have to be. If it sets off an alarm, run with it. If it doesn't, walk away. One more. Eight of Wands reversed. Doors slamming. You're drained. You don't trust yourself. 
I'm not moving forward. And there's no communication. There's no forward movement. Just knock the wind out of your sails a little bit. Some of you may be having self-worth issues. Why is the sun card here? Four of Cups reversed, Eight of Swords reversed. Five swords reversed. They may have come back trying to hand you a cup again and you're like, no. No. Or someone else tried to come in with a cup and you're like, no. Could swing either way. I think you just left the shattered pieces there. You know what? It was a great connection. It was fun while it lasted. I'm trying to make the sun shine again. I'm trying to put this out of my head. I'm... I can't. I, I don't want to pick the pieces up. Some of you could be ignoring how you felt. Or how it made you feel. We set that up there with the emotional closing off. My cup wasn't good enough. Up yours. Pretty much. Slamming doors. Not trusting your own judgment. Self-worth issues. Not moving forward. Trying, but you're, but you're not. Why is the three of cups reversed here for what's going to happen this week? Whoa. Not taking, not taking that many. Try again. Oh. Okay. Well, it handed me three, so... King of Wands, the Star, and the Nine of Wands. That's, that's awesome energy. You're not reuniting. You're healing. You're moving forward. And you're pushing through. Your walls are up, but you're pushing through. But you know what? This is my show and I'm running it my way. And I'm going to get through this. I love this. I hated this energy five minutes ago. I like this now. I don't know about that Ten of Swords reverse, though. Why is the Ten of Swords reversed here? Seven of Pentacles. Hmm. Queen of Pentacles reversed. Popped out again. Six of Swords. This could be their energy. Maybe you're leaving them with the sun not shining in their world. They may be patiently waiting for you to come back around. And you're like, no. If my cup wasn't good enough, neither is my pentacle. And you're moving on. Which signs I like it. Let's get your advice. Let's get your advice. I like it. A 
Three of Pentacles reversed. Four of Cups reversed. If somebody's trying to build a foundation on shaky ground, you beware of what is in that cup. If it was shaky before, it may well be shaky again. That's the third reversed three, by the way, coming out. This feels very third party. Fool in the upright, the two of cups in reverse. Look before you leap. More specifically, if you're going to leap, be careful who you leap with. Make sense? I think it makes sense. Six of cups, wheel of fortune. Okay. Probably have a lot of happy memories with this person. You may well have been playing the game with them for a minute. And this cycle is just ready to come to an end. Be that as it may. Sometimes, especially when we're dealing with soulmates, which... Hmm, the sun and the high priestess here, I think that's what you were dealing with. Sometimes soulmates just come in. Do what they need to do. Steer you where you're supposed to go on the path, and sometimes it's painful steps. But the steps you gotta take, because you're supposed to learn something from it. You're supposed to take something out of the experience, and you may not know in the moment what you're supposed to take out of it. You may not figure it out for a minute. Just take the happy memories with you. Allow it to close out if it's meant to. The Wheel of Fortune is the Wheel of Time. This specific particular one is the Wheel of the Year, by the way. Justice in the Upright, Page of Swords in the Reverse. You need to do what you need to do to regain balance. Okay. That's fine. When making the decision about this, you need to make it fairly. And if that means having to cut someone out, that means having to cut someone out. But you need to be fair. Don't be deceitful. You need to be honest. Okay. Be honest with yourself. Be honest with the other person. I'm not a sugar coater. You guys know this. Okay, Earth signs, I hope it helped. Let's clean up this card salad we got going on here. Okay. That was fun. Keep your head up, Earth signs. Cool part about it, the sun's always shining on you, just sometimes the sun's behind a big dark cloud. Alright. Air signs. Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. What do you guys got going on? Wheel of Fortune, Ace of Wands, gosh, more cycles closing out. Wheel of Time spinning in your favor. Looks like a match is striking this week, possibly with a, possibly with a fire sign, could be. 
could be any one of the fixed signs, so Taurus, Virgo, no. Taurus, to go through it in my head for a second, Taurus, Leo, Scorpio, Aquarius, right? Yeah, yeah. Sorry. My brain gets melded for a second. Okay. Long weekend. Any fixed sign. If I screwed that up, just look it up. Uh, King of Pentacles reversed, Six of Swords reversed. Oh, wow. in the past. An offer that may have been revoked may have come back around? There's a return here. Something slowly making its way back toward you. Eight of Pentacles reversed, Ten of Wands reversed. You didn't put the work into it. Something you had to get off your chest. Could be they had to get it off their chest. Somebody didn't put work in. It's going. I'm going to throw clarifiers on this because I'm wholeheartedly confused right now. Coming in this week, Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands, Six of Wands. Definitely some Wands coming in this week. Communication, victory. Fast forward movement. Let's get some clarity. What is going on? Whoa! Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity in the cards on the table for my air sign friends, please? Gemini, Libra, Aquarius for the coming week. Matches striking. Old cycles ending. New cycles beginning. The Wheel of Time spinning. Throwing me for a loop here. The fool came out. I didn't ask a question yet. Put it right there. <sighs> Somebody's taking the leap. Why is the King of Pentacles reversed to? Page of Wands. Fast communication came in from something that I don't know, may have been denied in the past, may not have been what it was presented to be, possibly. Could be a person. One more on that, please. Oh, I'll take two. Nine of Wands upright, Nine of Swords in the reverse. You had walls up. You were just trying to put it out of your head. You did not see this coming. You didn't even fathom this. 
Because you had barriers up. You were just, they forget about it. I don't want to deal with it. Why is six swords here? Star reversed. One more. Three wands reversed. You walked away from this. King of Cups. May have been a little bit of negative energy flow. Either you held the cup for them or they held the cup for you. One of you walked away, the other person hadn't quite healed yet, or couldn't heal, there was a return. They possibly came back in and said, I still hold a very full cup for you. Wow. Okay. Why is the Eight of Pentacles reversed here? Queen of Pentacles reversed pops out again. Okay. Sorry. First time for this script. Strength reversed again. Oh my gosh. You were drained. You did not have the work to put into this. You didn't have the energy to put into it. Three of cups, two of cups. Period. Another return. Closing the gap. Oh my gosh. Just kept hammering away at it. Possible water sign energy. They wanted to close the gap. They wanted a reunion with you. Why is the Ten of Wands here? Why is the Ten of Wands reversed here? Nine of Pentacles reversed. Four of Pentacles reversed. This is very burdensome. This connection was very burdensome. It was very codependent. Eventually you had to let go. One more on that. Air signs, it's like the second you stop putting work into it and the second you walk away from it, they came running back. And I think it happened more than once. There was argumentative energy, too. Confrontational. I think when you finally said enough was enough, it got confrontational, possibly.
Seven of Pentacles reversed, you're done waiting. You're letting go, you're releasing it, you're walking away. You're done with it. What's coming on this week? Eight of Wands in the upright. Why is Eight of Wands here? Eight of Wands reversed. One more. You're cutting communication off. This is like forward movement with a cut off in communication. I think you finally cut them off for good. Emperor reversed. Knocking the wind right out of their sails. Yep, making a judgment call. Karma, page of swords reversed, you're done. You're done. You are knocking an emperor off their horse this week. Knock him out of their throne. You're done. I think you're taking a leap of something else. What I'm thinking. Very quick, passionate leap. And I smell victory and it smells good for my air signs. Why is the Six of Wands here? Six of Cups reversed. Oh, don't be getting salty. Ace of Cups. Three of Pentacles. You still got a nasty taste in your mouth for the old, but you got new coming in. It's passionate. It's a cup full of love. Something you can build a foundation on. It's going to be victorious. I love it, air signs. I love it. One more. Okay, I'll take three. Yep. Going to juggle a few emotions, but you're not putting work into it. And you're going to do what makes you happy. You're going to fill your cups with positive things. I like it. Let's get your advice. It's beautiful. Page of Wands in the reverse and the Eight of Swords. Do not... Keep trucking on your path and don't stop. Don't that little don't let that little lizard in the path scare you from moving forward. And don't let it consume you. Do not let your thoughts consume you. Put those old nasty thoughts right out of your head. The lovers in the reverse, death in the reverse. Clearly, this old connection somebody was feeling it more than the other person and that probably was not going to change one of you was spiritually farther ahead than the other and well if that's not going to change it's not going to change you need to do what's right for you and if moving forward and now waiting for someone to not spiritually grow is what's best for you, then so be it. And you need to go on your spiritual path and do your thing and do you to your highest good. The Tower and the King of Pentacles. The Tower is in the reverse. Rebuild your tower to your abundant standards. Absolutely. I mean, you're the catch. This is the card. This is the one you want. This is the one you want. And I think this has something to do with this. And this. And I like it. 
build your tower the way you want to build to your highest possible good and your abundance okay Temperature reverse now to wand reverse not sure who this is for but i'm feeling it playing in there's negative energy flow Even a little bit. Don't. Don't let it come in and out of your life. Say, get out. Don't let them keep being non-committal Joe. And messing with your energy. Okay? All right. Wow, this is going to be a long one. Whew. Been at this for almost an hour. Wow. You know, sometimes it takes me 15 minutes, sometimes it takes me a couple hours. And yeah, usually the the Monday night or Monday readings take a little bit longer because I'm pretty freaking tired. So I wonder what it has in store for my water sign friends. Hmm. Give that a quick shuffle. Okay. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. What are you guys headed for this week? Or what's headed for you? What are you going to collide with? Beware, it's fire season. Fire energy moves quick. Four cups, knight of wands. Well, at least from this perspective, you're looking up at the cup. You're acknowledging the cup. You're not staring down at the past, but... Somewhere between celebration and sadness. That, it's a segue card to me. Possibly some non-committal energy. A little bit of in and out. In and out, up, down, back, forth, left, right. Not sure if they want to stay or go. Not sure if you want to stay or go. Not sure if you're ready to commit yet. It's just staring up at the cup. In the past, we have a death reversed and an empress in the upper right. Ah. Not on the same spiritual plane you weren't. I mean, you knew they had something with this empress. Maybe you both wanted it, but it just wasn't there. What happened next? Nine of swords, four of wands. Oh my. A sleepless nights. There's definitely a connection here. Standing at the open door wondering if you're going to walk in. Hmm. Okay. This week, the Hermit and the Seven of Swords. Oh. Hmm. That's why you're hesitating. That's why you're not sure. Okay. That's why you're just staring up the cup wondering if you're going to grab it. There's something 
shady going on. Possibly. Maybe you sense it. Maybe that's what you've been chewing on those sleepless nights. That's why you're not walking through the door yet. You're just standing there. I think this week you're going to be some doing some internalizing. Maybe you're the one who did, hadn't done some spiritual growth yet in the past, and you're you're about to start doing that. Okay, fair enough. Universe, source, and spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards in the table for my water sign, friends, please? Cancer, spicy. Wow. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Cancer, spicy, Scorpio. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio for the upcoming week, please. That's it, Pisces. I'm just going to start calling you spicy. That's, that's all there is to it. My spicy Pisces. Why is death reversed here? Hi. Ten of Pentacles flew out. Flew. That's the big brick house with the white picket fence and the pool and the 2.5 kids and the dog and all that happy jazz. That is the life's dream. One more. Eight of Pentacles reversed. You saw the dream before you. You just either couldn't put the work in or the other person wasn't putting the work in. Somebody wasn't putting work into the connection. Like it was right there. One more. Okay, I'll take two. Shadow side reversed. High priestess reversed. Somebody had to disconnect from some toxic crap. Could have been you, could have been them. Remember, energy is fluid, so if it's not resonating with you, water sign friends, it may resonate from the other person's point of view. Somebody wasn't listening to their intuition. It's right there, not putting the work in. Why is the Empress here? Okay, I dropped you. Try that again. You come back out, cool. Ace of Cups. Three of Swords reversed. Ace of Cups reversed. They're the one, but you're not taking your cup. You're not taking the cup because you're still coming out of a state of sadness from something else. Couldn't put the work in because you're disconnecting from other stuff, not listening to intuition. The world and strength come out. Closing out of cycles. Learning to trust again. I mean, my gosh, it's right there. It's right there. You just couldn't take the cup. Closing stuff out. Why is the Nine of Swords here? Six of Wands reverse, Knight of Swords in the upright. Yeah. A lot of sleepless nights, a lot of vulnerability, no victory. Communications there. 
Or at least it hasn't been cut off yet. Maybe you haven't blocked each other off each other's Facebooks or Instagrams yet. And you can still peek in and see things. That might be what, what's keeping you up at night. They're closing out cycles. Hmm. That's four wands here. Game of Pentacles pops out. That's one hell of an open door, guys. Chariot. Could be a cancer you're dealing with, doesn't necessarily have to be. I have Aries on the board, I have Taurus on the board, I have Gemini, I have Leo, I have Virgo. The door is open and you could go places. They're the one you want, they're still the catch, but you're vulnerable. One more on that. Some of you may be a little afraid to walk through the door. Four of Pentacles. Holding on to something. There's still something hanging you up. Guarding your money, guarding your heart, guarding your energy. Something you're not willing to let go of yet. Two of swords reversed. Difficult decisions got to be made. Why is the hermit here? Three of cups. The moon and the page of wands, the moon and the upright, page of wands in the reverse. <clears throat> you could. Six of wands comes out. Some of you could decide after some internalization to move forward with a friendship, but not with anything passionate or of that nature. Because there's just too much you don't know. Some of you may decide to move on from it. Take it out of it resonates. Why is the Seven of Swords here? reversed. Somebody might be being sneaky. Negative energy. Possibly a little bit impatient. Knight of Pentacles. Ten of Swords. Seven of Swords can also be a card of making plans and not letting anybody in on your on your secrets. And the Temperance Reverse isn't necessarily negative energy. It could just be impatience. Think slowly after some internalization this week. The cycle is going to come to an end. The sun will shine again. But you're working through it. And that's a good thing. I'll be honest with you, I'd be staring up at the cup too if I went through this. 
if I was even a little bit unsure. There was even something a little bit not quite right. I, I'd be like, you know what? I don't know. I'm still working through some stuff. So you're working through it. They're working through it. You have to close chapters before you can start new ones, right? It's always a good idea. Seven of Wands upright, Chariot upright. There it is again. Maybe you're dealing with an air sign. I don't know. Drive your chariot where you want it to go. It's your show. Run it your way. The Four of Pentacles and the Sun. Hold on to what you need to hold on to. Let go of what you need to let go of. But ultimately, it is your happiness, your abundance, that needs to be the most important to you. You need to make you happy. It's okay to make you happy. The Queen of Swords, the sun pops out again. You have to be honest with yourself. You have to be honest about the situation. And if that means you have to cut someone out, it means you have to cut someone out. It is what it is. But be fair about it. Lovers in the upright, two of pentacles in the reverse. Yes, this is a very strong, deep connection. Probably soulmate connection felt by both of you. And what have I said a thousand times about soulmate connections? They do not always come to stay. Sometimes they come to teach you something. Hmm. Let's throw one more on that. Seven of Cups and the Ace of Pentacles. If you need to realign yourself and come back into balance, because the connection isn't quite balanced, maybe you're not spiritually on the same level, that's okay. Go forth, do what you need to do if it comes back. And that seed you planted just grew a little bit slow, that's okay too. Hmm. As far as your options go, you've got plenty. But just keep in mind, and I do not believe in wrong paths. I don't believe all paths lead to your destination. It's just how you want your journey to go depends on what path you take. Just be mindful of what cup you pick. Be mindful. Not every cup that gets handed to you has good things in it, so be mindful. Okay. You guys are amazing. Thank you for your patience. I love you all the bits. Thanks for coming by. I will see you guys on Friday for your weekend top and bottom of the deck. And depending on how the rest of the week goes, if I'm feeling froggy tomorrow or Wednesday or Thursday, I might do a special, I don't know. And I know I gotta start doing the uh, readings for August for everybody this week, so let's we'll see how it goes. But this closes my work week officially, so again, thanks for coming by. I love you guys to death. At the very latest, I'll catch you Friday. <laughs>